Okay, so in the US, we have thrift stores, Goodwill, that sort of thing. But in New Zealand, they're called opportunity shops. I love that name. Do you love that name? It's an opportunity to get a deal. So let's go shopping in the city of Wellington at Opportunity Shop. Okay, so we're off to Wellington. So I get a lot of things from the Opportunity Shops. Like, you know, most of the stuff for the house. There's so many things that you can get. Some obviously are better than others. Um, but sometimes they can still be a little bit pricey, uh, I would say, especially in the city, but a lot cheaper than buying it new and pretty much can get kind of everything you need to kind of set up your whole house. So let's check it out. What? Let me see. They're John Lennon glasses. Oh, yes. Oh, I like those changing rooms. These are titles only Americans would write. The best American travel writing. Okay, same sweatshirt, $6, $65. So we've done a half a day. We're about to head to lunch. We're gonna go to Sal's Pizza, which is a really good American style pizza. They get the cheese from Wisconsin. Um, they import some stuff from New York. I don't remember what exactly, but we've done well. What have we gotten so far? We got a lot of stuff. Uh, we got a lot. What I got do we Magic get? Eight ball. Magic 8-Ball clothes. So got some Doc, Martin. I got Doc free. Martins for... Free. Oh, free, free, free glasses. Free what else? Oh, you got um, bean bag. And yeah, doing good. Okay, so today I'm here at Op Shop. This is the St. Vinny's? Yeah. Okay. This is Michael, and what's your name? Ethan. Yeah, he recognized me from the channel, so I thought I'd put him on here. <laughs> and how long have you worked here? Uh, a few years now. A few yeah. years, okay. Okay. And where do you get most of your stuff? Is it just the locals bringing it in? Yeah, people just bring it in. And speaking of which, have you got oh, something for sorry. us? Yeah. Oh, sorry. Oh, here we go. We got a here. donation. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. We, um, we don't have a back room here at our shop, so oh. everything has to get processed here at the counter as it comes in. Oh, okay. Yeah, whereas other, a lot of people, a lot of shops, you know, they've just got something where they can right. just sort in, in the back and... Do you own the shop happen. or you just work at the shop? Yeah, yeah, yeah I just work You work at the shop. And so then does, yeah. what percentage goes to the St. Benny Society? Well, so all of the um, money that we 
generate from sales is all used to run abundant services that oh. um, society runs. So yeah, oh, cool. yeah, and different um, so areas. So all of the money, other than operating. Yeah, we yeah. have obviously this, you know, overheads yeah, and overheads, stuff, right. but anything. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Well, most of the time I'm like volunteering, so. Oh, Most, you really yeah. are. Yeah, oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. So it's um. Oh yeah. Um. Is it? I think. Oh yeah. We should be able to. I think take this kind of heater. There's some heaters that we can't take, but um, I think this is one of them. So that we can. Oh yeah, that's nice. Oh my gosh, look at those gold pants behind there. Just saw those. <laughs> Michael, you like those, don't you? <laughs> Look at those. Yeah, oh, they're, oh my God, they're brand new. Even as a um, teenager. But yeah, <laughs> I, they attract a lot of attention. <laughs> okay, back to what we were saying. Like, what kind of services does it pay for? Yeah, well, so um, for like Wellington, we have. Um, uh, like food support that we um, run for a bunch of clients and um, oh, okay. yeah and then the local Vinnie's conferences have a bunch of um, outreach that they do and mm. so there's different um, ways that they can help people through that. We have a clothes and goods bank as well wow. so things have been you know kind of tough for a lot of people, yeah, for a lot of people recently like that. and but that's also made things quite difficult for us as well because as um, people are finding it harder demand for our services goes up but often revenues go down, down right. so we've had to so is that why you're volunteering oh well I, I i just wanted to you know kind of volunteer to help out yeah, in yeah. my local community and, community yeah and so I you think, live around here yeah yeah, yeah. just down the road okay. yeah all of our volunteers in this store are local and the case for most stores We've had to streamline a lot of our services, mm -hmm. so okay. instead of um, being able to kind of provide everything as a kind of wraparound service, mm -hmm. which has a number of benefits, right. we've had to kind of work out um, what we can provide that there's a, a lack of in other areas, and uh. so we're you know kind of branching out and part partnering with a lot more other organizations oh, as well. Oh, yeah, working yeah. together, right? Yeah. Um, but, you know, at the moment, it's kind of, things are quite tight financially. So I think all charities are kind of oh, feeling the pinch at the moment, you know? All so. right, well, I have a lot to donate sitting in my garage, so I'll be bringing it. Nice to meet you, Michael. Yeah. Thanks for sharing a little bit about it. So it's raining, and we're up in kind of the hills by Wellington, Karori, Kel Kelbourne, I'm um, going into some shops, but, ooh, getting tired. Okay. <laughs> getting that, Sydney? What do you think? What is it? I don't know, but I'm getting it. 2015 Doctor Who, you're still getting it. There's a whole Doctor Who game over here. Where? Okay, you don't even know what it is. I don't care. <laughs> Five bucks. Okay, so we have, how many hours have we been doing this? It's like 4.11. Like we, we left about nine and it's 4.11 and we had lunch and we had a little bit of a, what would we say? Morning tea. We've been drinking. Oh. So we got so much. We got a dresser. We got lots of clothes. I got a picture. Three forty-seven. So many things. Games. What else? Shoes. I have no idea. Yeah, it was just a big score. How much do we think we spent? Though? I spent definitely over hundred. Over hundred. The fourteen-year-old spent maybe. over hundred. We spent a couple hundred. I spent not much, but it was good. I spent so, like twenty dollars. There was opportunity shops, then there were hospice shops, and hospice shops support the palliative care in that community, so it takes care of the elderly, and it's amazing. So those tend to be really nice. So there was Mary's Hospice, Pate Omonga Hospice was good, and so they have really nice stuff, and it goes to really support an amazing thing. It, like All of the money completely goes to that, as far as I know. 
and yeah and you know then the Salvation Armies and the St. Vinnie's all help all the local charities so it's an amazing way to save money and also support the community and it's just a win-win all around we won we did good today Woohoo!